Here in particular, we see NGC 3351, one of our targets. In the top half, we see an HST image. And in the bottom half, we see the image from JWST. Um, this galaxy in particular has what's called a, a bar, a stellar bar, where there's a overdensity of stars that causes gas to basically flow into the center where it piles up in this big ring um, right around the nucleus of the galaxy. You can see that showing up brightly both in the JWST and HST images. Um, the gas that piles up in that ring then goes on to form a huge amount of stars and so it glows very brightly in the infrared um, from the light of all of those stars that have formed. And we can also see that this stellar bar and the inflow of gas has actually swept out kind of an empty region um, in the galaxy where most of the interstellar gas has been funneled into the center, leaving kind of this gap that you see here. Um, the other nice thing that JWST images really clearly show us are the locations of all of the star forming regions, which in the bottom half image you can see as these bright um, clumps in the, in the image. These are places where the dust has been heated up to high temperatures based on the radiation from massive stars that have formed there. Um, you can also see star formation happening in the top half of the image, where in the HST filters, it shows up as very blue stars that are bright when they are um, not uh, covered up by dust. 